Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpo Gaming in another Destiny 2 video. Another one. Yeah, I finally got the tusk of the boar and did some testing on this bad boy. We tested it out in PvE and in PvP. Today, we're going to find out how good this really is. Let go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. Now, in order to get this, you will have to open up those lovely iron engram packages hopefully you can get a little lucky and get the tusk of the boar this is a brand new grenade launcher that was released for this season and now is our chance to get it the roll i got is pretty good i have implosion rounds i have sever chain reaction on this bad boy and a reload masterwork so i immediately went over to like gg and well it's pretty good in pvp at 4.4 but only a 2.0 in pvp so I decided to do some testing. Now in PvE, it, it absolutely shines. This weapon has some pretty good, I just nutmeg that dude, yep. But <laughs> we have some pretty good damage on this grenade launcher. Against adds, it's really nice. The impact damage, if you don't hit him with the wave, is pretty decent, but it's also one of the most things that I kinda don't like about it. In order to use this weapon, the proper way you want to use the wave feature of this great launcher which is shooting it a little bit right below their feet and letting the wave hit them now if you use it like that it absolutely shines and you can get some pretty good damage and you can wipe a lot of ads with this weapon it is really good in pve i had a lot of fun playing with it and i'm pretty sure you will too you can even hit enemies behind objects as well which is a pretty nice perk when it comes to this wave frame grenade launcher. So according to LightGG, a 4.4 out of 5. Yeah, okay. I can definitely see why I gave it a 4.4 out of 5. It's actually really good. The only drawback I have is the impact damage. And that is only because I love my Wither Horde. And I'm just used to that. But there is some significant damage you can get from straight impact if you don't hit them with the wave. And for PvP... Well, cue that montage music. There you have it, the Tusk of the Boar grenade launcher. Pretty good in PvE, and it was pretty good in PvP. I definitely think it's a whole lot better than 2.0 that was up on my GG, but I digress. You let me know what you think about the Tusk of the Boar down below. But for right now, that's pretty much going for the video. Hope you truly enjoyed it. As always, if you're new to the channel, how you doing and welcome. And don't forget to subscribe, right here at Carpool Gamer, or the wide variety of videos range from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So once again, thanks for watching. As always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.